Here's one simple project that you can do with only the parts included in your nerd kit. It's a very simple project, but it's great to get started. The system uses six of the dip switches to represent two three-bit numbers. The switches can be up or down to represent ones and zeros. We display the two numbers on the LCD and add the two numbers. I have taken the same setup as a temperature sensor project and just removed the temperature sensor to free up the input pins. Then I plug in the zip switches. We haven't used this component yet, but it's really simple. When the switch is in the on position, the two pins below it are connected. When the switch is down, the two pins are disconnected. The component you have has seven of these pins in one package. I plugged the dip switch into the breadboard down here where we have room. I connected the first six pins on one side to ground and connected the other side of the pins to six free pins on the microcontroller. We are going to be using the internal pull-up resistors on the chip to pull up the voltage when the switch is disconnected. When we flip the switch on, it will make a connection between the pin and ground, pulling the voltage down to zero. Then, I wrote some pretty simple code to read the inputs from the dip switches. First, we set the pins to input mode. Then, we turn on the input pull-up resistors. We declare some variables to store our bits. Then, in the main loop, it's as simple as reading each bit and putting them together to form 3-bit numbers and displaying them on the LCD. Here, I added the two numbers, but you can choose any arithmetic operation you want. The first three dip switches are the first number. The second three are the second number. If I turn on the least significant bit of each number, we can see that 1 plus 1 equals 2. You can do this for any number you can represent using only three bits. For the source code to this project, information about our electronics kits, or more videos like this one, go to www.nerdkits.com.